But I think I can help people see something differently that all of us are going to have to deal with with somebody we care about. People think of Alzheimer's sort of like a crocodile. It comes and it just, you know, bites in your head and everything is gone. And I said, it's really more like a mouse nibbling on a big piece of cheese. It nibbles away a little, a little bit at a time. And our job is to say, is not just to focus on what's gone, but to say, how can we find what's still there? And we focus on that and we nourish that and we cherish that. And, and we can still have good relations with the people that we love and we care about. What I imagine and what most people still think of is that people with Alzheimer's are really empty shells. There's not a person still there. There's a woman named Hilda, and, and uh, I have some photos of her that I took, who would ask me, where's my room? Where's the bathroom? You know, did I eat lunch? Is, is my husband still alive? I and mean, all the kinds of losses that they have. But Hilda could sit at the piano and I suddenly saw her at the piano, and she could play two to three hundred songs from memory, sing all the words to them. That was astounding. Mm -hmm.